Party! Sorry, that's as good as it gets. It's a beautiful day today. Absolutely gorgeous. It's warm, I'd say probably mid 60s, upper 60s. Very warm inside the car because the sun is just screaming down. <clears throat> we got our state refund today, so I got a little bit of money. So, uh, which means we're gonna be able to have ice. <laughs> Haven't had ice in a while. So, I'm running to the store and Val is sleeping. And uh, basically, I think this is probably going to be about two weeks because that's how long the doctor said it's going to take for the medication to kick in. And so she's just trying to rest through the whole thing. So again, I will try to get her into the video, but no guarantees. So she's doing okay though. She's alive. <laughs> Just uh, sleeping. Alrighty, something's going down. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna go to Home Depot and uh, look for some stuff for my fireplace set. This is the uh, fireplace that I have. It's your standard 1960s Fred Flintstones rock brawl and um, it does not have a hearth. And I'm going to be filling these holes with a couple of pieces of um, uh, sandstone that I bought which I'm going to have to shape and then just uh, uh, mortar in. But the hearth is going to be a little bit more of an issue because um, it's going to have to be square like, like this, sharp edges, because I'm putting flooring down. And my first impression would be to simply buy some more of these stones and just attach them right to the floor. And it would look, it would uh, match and look okay. But I wouldn't be able to uh, really cut around it well with the, uh, the flooring. So I have to have a square. And then I can put the stones on top of that. So I got two inches to work with. Most pavers are about two inches. I was hoping to get something a little thinner uh, so that I could put some sandstone on top of that. Okay, so here I am, I'm at the Home Depot. And this is probably what I'm going to get. These are 12 by 12 by one and a half inch red concrete pavers, dollar 24 each. Uh, my hearth is six feet wide, so that's, I'm going to need 12 of them. It'll be 24 inches uh, out, which I think is too far, so I'm going to have to cut them. But this will give me a square hearth, and then I will cover it with a um, these sandstone paver. Okay, so this is the sandstone paver which I'm going to put on top of it. And um, it's about an inch thick. Some of it is different. So I have to be very careful what I get. But, um, and that's about a dollar square foot as, as well. And uh, so while we'll get these two, it'll be about an inch, about a half an inch higher than the hearth box, the um, fire box. I don't think that's an issue. If somebody else thinks that it could be, let me know. But um, it's a, this will be a, an inexpensive way of fixing this. Uh, all right, so I just uh, left Home Depot. And now I'm on my way to the pharmacy. Val's doctor called. And we changed her medication back to um, the first one. We went through three changes. The first one uh, worked well for her depression, but it made her hungry. The second one didn't make her hungry, but it gave her migraines. And uh, I had to keep an eye on somebody. And the, uh, the one that she's on now doesn't seem to be helping her in any way, shape, or form. It's, it's giving her a headache. And uh, so, 
we're going to go back to the first. And we're going to have to keep an eye on her uh, eating because it does make her hungry. Stop that a stoplight. Nobody stop sign. Nobody wants to move. Okay, so this is the end of this video. Hope there's something in there that you enjoyed. Uh, I got Val's medication. We should know in the next day or so uh, if that's going to do the trick. And um, if you liked it, give us a thumbs up, a share, and a subscription. And we will see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Bye.